Hi Michael. Um, listen, I've just been in there with my bosses. And it's not good news. You're not going to like what I'm going to say to you. Can I get you to take a seat, please? Take a seat. I knew that putting you in the constant night shift, that wasn't a good idea, was it? I knew something like this was going to happen. I mean, what about this Jason? For God's sake. Why did you have to hit him? Because you're both Michael. You do know what that means, don't you? Gross misconduct. Instant sackable offence. Because you're both Michael. I have no choice in the matter. You're stuck. You can't put it now. Understand that, Michael. I'm disappointed in you, Michael. I thought we were friends. And listen, I've stood up for you three times already to my bosses. I can't do it anymore. And what they've said to me is you've got ten minutes to get your stuff together and get out of here. I'm getting nothing out of you. Ten minutes, Michael. Well, that's us done then. We really need to work on our anger issues. I mean, once again, we come into work, bring our issues from home, and now we've been sacked. I'll say one thing, well, that was a good right hook you gave him. But speaking of stuff from home, more importantly, she's at it, and what are we gonna do about it? I mean, we're here every single night, and she's at home by herself. What are you waiting for? She is at it. You know it. We all know it. We've got the evidence to prove it. Just come on, she's at it. We need to get her. Teach her a lesson and whatever she's with. Who is she with, by the way? Exactly. Let's get home and get her. Catch him right at it. Go! You're back early. Am I? What's wrong? How are you up so early? That was my fault, mate. Sorry. Me and Jackie fell out last night. We had a horrible fight. I didn't know where else to go, to be honest. So I thought where else better than my lovely sister-in-law and brother's house. Do you know she even sat up and listened to my tales of woe? What was I supposed to do? She even let me crash in the spare bedroom. Yeah, she's good like that. Do you want a coffee? I'm making another one for me and Thomas. Do I want a coffee? Are you okay? Yep. Mikey, what's wrong? Nothing.
Ich spüre schon hier. Das bin nur die Schlippen in der Bett. Und dann will ich nur sagen, dass ich bin schlippen in der Spare Room. Weil es definitiv nicht die bin schlippen in der Spare Room. What room is he talking about? Or maybe it's just a case of once again, he wants what we've got. Go check the other room. See if I'm lying. Come on, let's go. <laughs> There's been someone sleeping in that bed. I mean, He's always been better than us. Especially with the girls. It wasn't just Sarah and Jane, was it? What a chub. You almost had us believe in him for a minute. <laughs> it's time to wake up. What are they up to down there? Well, I know. Let's get down there and find out. What are you waiting for? Let's go! We need to tell him. We can't let this go on any longer. It's unfair to Lizzie. I know. He's never really come out for me. He's been in What are they talking about in there? Come on, man! This is it! This is your wife! Do not bottle it now. This is the only chance we'll get. You need to wake up! Carry on. I heard everything. I know what's going on. Mike, you have to listen. I have to listen? Yeah. I've had your shit for years. It was me who stayed. What's this? The guilt trip, is it? You know I couldn't have stayed. Of course not. Not the better, brother. You disappear off and leave our mother and me. I was being smothered by her. I couldn't take any more of her shit. I was like dealing with her. You know exactly why he had to leave, Michael. Why are you even bring this up again? You were always looking for approval. You couldn't stand me being free. You lived half an hour away. You didn't care about me. Please. You didn't care about mum. You didn't care about anyone. I cared. I cared! I just couldn't take any more of her shit! You were too busy. Swanning off like stop. Swanning off like what, Michael? Stop it. Swanning off like what? Say it. Say it. Their bed hasn't even been slept in. I look. Michael, you can't think. It's not even possible. Michael, you have you have to calm down. Michael. You have to believe me. Nothing is happening. Oh, you're right. I didn't sleep here last night. I've only just arrived myself. He's been doing this kind of shit to me for years. What are you talking about? You know exactly what I'm talking about. You and Sarah. Oh my god, are you being serious? Michael. It's all in your head, okay? Now just calm down before somebody gets hurt. Oh, and me and Tracy? I haven't. No offence, Tracy. I've heard all this shit before. Oh, well, nothing's going on. It's not even possible, Michael, you know that. No, you're right. You and Tracy do have something to talk about. No, Thomas, not now, please. What is it? What is it? I've been trying to tell you for weeks. I understand, Michael. I could never have an affair with Tracy. I couldn't. I came out when I was 14. That's why I couldn't hang around Mum. I had to leave. That's why you stayed. It's not about you. It's me. Stop being better than me. Michael. Michael. Sarah, enough. Michael, it's Tracy. I'm your wife. Mum, we can sort this out. Yeah, I see it now. You and her. Listen, I've not had an affair with Tracy. She's, She's just been having a... Michael! Michael! Michael, get off him! Michael, get off him! <laughs> Michael! Thank you. 